Okay, so today I want to show you how to restore the red color back in your very blue GoPro videos. Um, we're going to use GoPro Studio so, since that's a freely available uh, software that you can get from the GoPro website. Today I've got a picture of a wreck here. It's looking very blue. It's not much color in it. It's clear though, but maybe we can bring the red color back even though I wasn't using a red filter. So there's a view of the corals there. All you need to do is go to the white balance section and pull the color temperature all the way over to the right and the tint all the way over to the left. As you can see, the colors have just popped out. Adjust this to what looks the most natural for your particular clip. I think that looks the best. All the way over to the right and the tint about here. Let's play the clip back again. Wow, the ship's colors have uh, really come out. This was all blue and now we've got all the rust in the ship. We've got all the colors back in the coral and there was no red filter used at all. If you want, of course, you can play with the saturation, the contrast, um, but what I really wanted to show you was how to counteract the loss of the red color at depth. And you do that with the white balance control, shifting the temperature to the right and the tint to the left. Saturation and contrast, play with it as much as you want to your own liking. One more clip I've got here. Here I've got this eagle ray uh, going over the bottom. This is the clip looking very blue, very kind of bluey green. Again, a red filter would have fixed this, but since I wasn't using a red filter in GoPro Studio, I can simply take the white balance temperature slider, slide it to the right, and the tint, slide it to the left. I can see the colors in the coral. It's looking good. So there's the colors. And without the correction, that's how it was. All right, that was the video, how to color correct your GoPro footage, how to bring back the red, even if you didn't use a red filter uh, using GoPro Studio. I will make another video showing you guys how to do this in Sony Vegas for those of you that are not using GoPros or those of you who are not using GoPro Studio. So um, this same technique uh, can be applied in different software su suits, uh, Adobe, uh, Vegas, etc. Uh, this is just how to do it in the GoPro Studio. All right, guys, thanks for watching and uh, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.